Mm. Yeah, we have. We've seen them and you know been impressed by them. I, w- I went to watch them last weekend at, down at Port Vale, and I was impressed by you know that they've got some good players. They they try and you know they try and play football. They can hurt you in different ways, and you know, obviously I know a few of the players as well, a few ex Everton players there as well, younger lads who I know and you know, I know they've got quality and I know they've got depth and you know they'll definitely be up there challenging this season. Are you looking uh, fitness wise? Lyle Taylor took a little bit of a knock the other night. How's he? Would, would, would he be in contention? He's struggling to be honest. He took he twisted his ankle on the pitch, which is which was a difficult one for us just after he came on. So, and Lyle's been been looking good, and um, it'd be nice to have him around, you know, to, for competition for places in those front places. But and we'll give him every chance to to make the game. Has it been difficult to pick up the lads after the, the late defeat the other night, or is it back to league action now that motivates them? Um, no, there's there's definitely a hangover in respect of you know because you don't like getting beat, you no know, no matter how how it happens and which competition. So there there was a disappointment, but we're over it now. We moved on and we've addressed it and addressed the reasons and and what we could have done better and, and what we did well as well. We can't forget about that. So you know we're we're over it now. We're moving on and we're we're really positive. You know after a good start against Notts County, then we want to build on that on Saturday. Oh,